And tonight, as loved ones continue to digest all of that, News Channel Line's Christina Galvin shows us how they plan to continue their prayers for Lizzie. We put it one status online, it went viral all over the place because she just, she's just nice to everybody, kind to everybody, and people love her. Thousands are looking to find justice for Lizzie, a loving sister, mom, and friend. Hopes and prayers continue to flood social media and throughout her community. It hasn't really hit me yet. I don't want it to because I just keep thinking I'm going to wake up and I'm going to, I'm going to be able to have dinner with her. While continuing to search for answers, Lizzie's family is now asking neighbors to change their porch lights to the color purple and use hashtags like Light for Lizzie and Justice for Lizzie. It's so hard. She's my best friend. She's not just my sister. Support is already pouring in. Friends and neighbors finding ways to help Lizzie's family during this difficult time. Tonight, a vigil will be held in Canastota across the parking lot from her house. The family is asking people to come wearing purple, the color representing domestic violence. In Canastota, Christina Galvin, News Channel 9. And tugs at your heartstrings. Thank you, Christina. At 11 tonight, we'll hear more from friends and family as they continue praying for Lizzie. Tonight's vigil will be held from 7 to 7.30 at 107 North Main Street in Canastota.